y'all. Welcome back to another banger reaction video with your boy, DR Elite, or is it Elite DR? I don't know, you tell me. But look though, y'all, check it out, man. We got Avery B. He just dropped a new video. I ain't even watched that whole yet. See what I'm saying? He dropped that bit about like 41 minutes ago. Let me go full screen. He dropped about 41 minutes ago. So I'm like, shit, let me go ahead and react to that motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Um, do jury make it easy to get a female? We finna find out. What y'all think? Let me know in the comments what y'all think about that. Do y'all think it's easier to get a female when you got jury on? Or not? But to keep it a band with y'all, depending on what female it is, nine times out of ten, it do like it do help you get females. It's it's females that fuck with niggas just cause they got money. Like niggas need money, fame, and hella stuff just to get females. Like some females wouldn't even mess with dudes if they really wasn't having certain type of shit, cars. Y'all see how them gold digger videos play out like that shit real talk. Them videos like real talk, real shit. Like some females just they only see you as materialistic shit. Females always be saying that, um, I had to take a sip. But females always be saying, damn, dudes always look at us as objects. I always want to use us for sex, this and that. But what are they doing with the dudes with money and cars and shit? They're using them the same way. But hey, look, going to get into it, man. Y'all yeah, see how that shit go with dope standards. It go both ways. Jury make it easier to get girls. Today, we're gonna put it to the test. I hired 10 girls to individually rate me and shape from one through 10, then pick who they would rather go on a date with. But what they don't know is each round will alternate juries so one person is iced out and the other person is not. At the end of the video, I will average both sides to see once and for all, does jury help you get girls? How you doing? Hi. Good, how you doing? You look good. Thank you. So, what do you look for in a woman? Uh, me, personally? You gotta be looking good, you know what I'm saying? I want a good head. Hey, I ain't gonna cap. This video low-key smart as fuck. This like on some King Sid shit. You know what I'm saying? Not saying he copying King Sid because he not, but like, the type like create the idea type shit. Like he, I ain't seen nobody do this shit. I ain't seen nobody do this video yet. You know what I'm saying? But niggas about to start doing this shit. Watch what I tell you, niggas about to start doing this. Just how they was copying King Sid. Watch what I tell y'all now. When y'all see that shit popping up on y'all YouTube timeline news feed, I'm gonna be like, I told you, motherfucker. I told you, goofy ass. Head in your shoulders, you know, I want you to be going to college. I don't know, somebody that really wants something with their life, you know what I'm saying? And a fat ass, I'm not gonna. <laughs> I'm a fat ass. Got ass. Fat ass. Fat ass. Working on a skinny girl BBL. Listen, I like I'm a model. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I like I like how you look. I like the tattoos. I'll fuck with you. Crocodile jeans, you know what I'm saying? Let me see your real quick. Got it, okay, got it. Get to that one time. I'm with it. But nah, I want somebody that got a good head on their shoulders and they ain't got no fucking gag reflex, so. What are you talking about? You choking? No, <laughs> <laughs> You're toxic. You are. Shit. I love that. Love that. Right, for me, I ain't gonna lie. I just want somebody with ambition because I'm a hustler. You need to match my grind. Like, I can't be going out working and my girl ain't doing no with us. So, you need motion. Like, I got motion. Here, baby. Motion yeah. plus motion equals. Mm. Mm. Big bags. You know what I'm saying? Well, thank you. Pleasure. Thank you. Yeah. One through ten, I definitely give, I give the shade. I give him a seven because he spoke on college and I mean, college is cool and cute, but I'm a hustler, baby. Like we've been here, I'm 27 years old. College is just over with for me. I'm a big grown girl. We did the college thing. Um, Avery, I'm gonna rate him a nine because I like dark skin men and I like his vibe. He definitely talked about hustling and I feel like I would let him take me on a date. So yes, I would rather date Avery. Thank you to Shay though. I know I'm cute or whatever, but I would definitely rather date Avery. Hi. How you doing? I'm good. How y'all doing? I'm good. So I guess my question is, 
Why didn't your last relationship work? Um, my last relationship didn't work basically because our mindsets was in two different places. We were high school sweethearts. I was elevating past the level and she was still on a, you know, typical college, go out on the weekends. Me, I was kind of more like that. So we mutually came to the agreement that we was going to stop talking. <laughs> Primero la H y la H de hip hop por siempre. Solamente aquí en Amazon Music. Bro, these goddamn ads. But I really don't know why Shawty had. Why Shawty got down said something about the college shit. Cause for y'all people out there watching, bro, you get your money however you get it. College ain't for everybody, you know what I'm saying? But ain't nothing wrong with college cause and you go to school, get your degrees and shit like that. Like, you gonna have a big bag. So it's like, I don't know why she was dog, down talking to Shay in that situation. Cause, you know what I'm saying? Like, you can get you can get a big bag from college. She said it like, you can't get no money from it type shit. Damn, dumb hoe. My bitch was a whore. Oh, oh, I wasn't the type to go out. She was always the type to go out. And then I broke up with her. And I'm like, why she always go out? Then I start going out and I start fucking hoes. So I'm like, this is why she's going out. Because she's getting fucked. <laughs> you feel what I'm saying? I mean, yeah, that's right. not why girls go out. But I guess I feel you if she was fucked. Yeah, nah. Like, this right here, what she's saying, that shit count. Girls go out. This is what it is. Girls go out to have fun and shit with their girlfriends. But, you know what I'm saying? If she going out, she on demon time. The shit right. His ex was probably getting crushed by hella niggas and he ain't even know it type shit. Like, don't let girls fool you with this little, with this little simple talk, brush over type shit, cause they capping with this shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, they, they getting crushed when they going out. They meeting dudes. They getting their numbers. Giving their numbers out. Flirting. Dancing, twerking on other niggas like, Go, go, go tell this shit to somebody who Go tell this shit to somebody who an idiot And don't tell it to me Cause I'm already knowing Oh no Fucking fool I'm already knowing what's going on Like stop playing with me Do I like I got stupid Written on my goddamn forehead hoe Do I like I'm stupid Okay then Stop playing that's why going my out. bitch was going out. Okay, well, if your bitch was going out like that, like then she okay, was, I feel like she you. She had this rapper and shit, and I'm just like, damn. Okay, well, that's why she was going out there. I feel you, but. How old is you? I'm 23. 23? Mm -hmm. I'm 18. Mm -hmm. I need somebody older than me. You're 18 for real? Yeah, I need somebody older than me that really got what is going on for real. You know? You 18? You be with the bad bitches in the fucking video. I be watching the videos. You be with the baddies. Are you 18? <laughs> well, them bitches catching cases, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> I'm that right now. I oh, okay. I guess so. I guess. All right, thank you guys. So if I could rate Avery on a scale from one to 10, I would give him a nine. He was cute. If I could rate Deshae on a scale from one to 10, I'd probably give him like a nine and a half. Bro, he had really nice skin, he was cute too. If I could pick who I would rather date, I would probably date Deshae. He had me weak, like he's funny as fuck. Avery was cool too, but Deshae just was fucking, he had me fucking weak, so. I think I'll pick Deshae. Hello. I'm Big Tiny. How are y'all? Big Tiny, was popular. Big Tiny. Big Tiny? My name is Destiny. That's the end of my name, Tiny. And I'm big just because I'm like that. Okay. Yeah. All right, so my one question for y'all is natural or BBLs? Who do y'all prefer? Natural. No, nah, I was going to go natural. Sure. Y'all lying? Nah. Nah, I ain't got nothing to get here. I ain't got nothing to get here. It's like when it come to natural in the BBL, of course, a nigga want natural. A natural ass, you know what I'm saying? The natural cheeks that he can just got down, grab, just put his face in and type of shit. But look though, y'all, um, when it come to BBLs, like me personally, I don't got nothing against BBLs, but it's just like, I don't know what to say, like, I ain't got nothing against BBL, it's just like we prefer natural, but we know it's fake, but I mean, it's still like, we we still hit, though. If like that ass fat still jiggling and shit, I'ma still hit, like, I don't care. Like, I really don't care, like, I prefer natural, but I'ma still hit at that ass fat and jiggling, you know what I'm saying? Like, so that's why I say it really don't matter, because I'ma still hit, I'ma still crush. 
Yeah. I'm saying I take a natural, you know what I'm saying? I like the vibe and stuff. Okay. Also, if you got a BBL, my dick can't take it, then it's just, I like to take a real natural thing. So what you trying to say? More control. Oh, okay. It's got mid dick. Okay. My dick mid. It's mid? Mid. Oh, shit. What made you ask that question? Huh? I'm just curious. What made you ask that Because a lot of dudes like BBLs, and I feel like, I feel like, you know, me, I don't got that side. That's fake. That's fake. So my question is How tall is he? <laughs> I'm seven foot two. Y'all kinda looking up to me. Anyways, what are y'all passionate about? Like I'm passionate about the creation process. This video, you know. What I'm oh, okay. Creation. Yeah. You laughing at my passion? No, no, you took a little second to answer that. Your turn. If you had to compare your pussy to a fast food restaurant, <laughs> what would you say? But it's like it's just not fast food. <laughs> but just give me this one. shit is like it's more like SDK or like, you know, maybe sundial where it takes its time. Mm, you know, it's marinated. Just, it's marinated. Mm. It's some good juice. That boy the straight trying to rush into the pussy, you know what I'm saying? That boy said fast food. That boy literally said fast food restaurant. Like he, he asked her if her pussy was a fast food restaurant, like what would it be? Wendy's, Chevrolet, Zaxby's, Chicken Tender, Zaxby sauce, dip it in a little ranch. You see what I'm saying? Like, that boy the shade is wild, boy. That boy be wilder. That boy the shade is crazy. Juices though. I like marinade. You don't pussy. want the bad juices. Yeah, right, right. You want the, right. you want the I don't good. Want that three minute pussy. Yeah. No, I'm yeah. saying I want that forty five minutes sirloin. I, I can do an hour or two. Are you lying? You not lasting no uh, hour. It, look, it just really depends. I last five minutes. I'm not gonna cat with. Wait, we talk about food, right? Now I'm yeah. talking no, about no, this. So What's so the longest you ever been in bed? The longest on a really drunk night. I, I think I stayed up till like seven in the morning. I got seven at night. <laughs> Oh, well, your shit was on limp. I'm sorry. Cut that out. <laughs> <laughs> <We're not good. laughs> or keep that shit in. <laughs> Where you from? I'm from Rhode Island, Providence, Rhode Island. It's the ocean stay. It's the ocean stay. You know what I'm saying? So y'all y'all talking damn. about. I feel like goddamn Kevin so Durant. Oh, God. We both play for the Houston Lakers. What's yeah. yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. Where's my tickets? I play with Cristiano Ronaldo and Messi. They're my teammates. So you talk like that? Yeah, you call me. Hey, what's your whole scene? Let go, let go, let go. Are you saying that just because I'm Afro Latina? No, I'm Afro Latina. Come on, see, let me see that. Mm. Oh, yeah. ah! I need to give. <laughs> Wait, what's your name? De La Rosa. Oh, De La Rosa. What if I told you I already knew that? He don't know that. He don't oh, know. Boy, hell. <laughs> 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 Where's my <laughs> shot? Oh, God. Period. I'm out. All right. Bye. If I was to rate Avery, I, you know, his hairline was really nice and crispy. Now you go lie to you. That crispiness, I think it bumped it up to a nice little solid nine. With these ass, y'all. I be skipping the fuck out of these ass, bro. This shade, he got jokes or whatever. You know, I think, you know, we just kind of, you know, the right height or whatever. I'm gonna give him a 9.5. Who would you rather date? <laughs> I mean, just based off of my interaction. Well, it's just that the shade was a bit more talkative. Avery, he cool too. He's very charming. They're both very charming. But I would have to go with. The shade. How you doing? I'm doing fine. Oh, these hoes, I don't know. It's like they ain't biting the jury too much. How are you guys? They ain't biting the jury too much. They ain't, I don't think they're really paying attention though. But at the same time, all these hoes, they already know them type shit. You know what I'm saying? These hoes already saying they be watching the video. Ooh, ooh. So they already know them. I think it would have went better if um 
if they had some females in the video that they that didn't know them at all, never seen them, but I know that's probably hard to come by. <clears throat> oh, shit. Needs to be burping all over the goddamn place, but yeah, if they had some hoes that got down, you know what I'm saying, didn't know them and shit like that, it probably went a little different, but these hoes like know them and shit. But I don't know if they paying attention to the jury, but I know they definitely see that motherfucker, but I don't know. Let's just see how the end of the video go, y'all. Doing young handsome man. Okay. <laughs> look, look at you. Oh, you you a funny one. Huh? Okay, I got something for you. I'm a big on family, mm. and I like a man who treats his mama right. Got a good relationship. Mm. So how's y'all relationship with y'all mama? Y'all grandma? I just talked to my mama. Oh, you just talked to her? Yeah, talked to my. What y'all talk about? We talked about family. <laughs> You got, you got kids? Do I want kids? You know what I'm saying? You talking about family? You got kids? No, dude. The nigga Avery told me something. We talked about family. And he just saying, just talking, bro. He just talking. He just talking, y'all. I'm family. Mm. And I like a man who treats his mama right. Got a good relationship. Mm. So how's y'all relationship with y'all mama? Y'all grandma? I just talked to my mama. Oh, you just talked to her? I just talked to my mama. What y'all talk about? We talked about family. <laughs> You got kids? Well, do I want kids? You know what I'm saying? You talking about family. You got kids? No, I ain't got no kids. Okay. You got five, so you a big family man. Yeah, I love a family man. I'm done. Okay. I live with my mama. Okay. You clean up around the house? Yeah. <laughs> so you a mama's boy? I just live with my mama. Okay. <laughs> I just live with my mama. Do you live with your mama? No, I do not. Okay. I live by myself. Can I live with you? Oh! What you mean? I'll clean up. What? They need to say funny as hell, bro. He talking about, I just live with my mama. I just be cleaning up. That nigga funny, bro. What'd he say? What'd that nigga ass say? Yeah, I love a family man. I'm done. Okay. I live with my mama. Okay. You clean up around the house? Yeah. <laughs> so you a mama's boy? I just live with my mama. Okay. <laughs> I just live with my mama. Do you live with your mama? No, I do not. Okay. I live by myself. Can I live with you? Oh! Is you me? I'll clean up after myself. Would you clean up after me? Of course. Okay, I'm gonna keep that in mind. That means you oh, can't keep female. That's what you're telling me. Oh, for sure not. <laughs> I clean. I cook, I clean, and I make sure the house is all scented with um, candles. She, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. I keep myself up to par. Don't play with me. No, don't play with me. Because you'll make me move out. Stop <laughs> playing. <laughs> all right, so that's my question for y'all. That was my question for you I would rate Avery a seven. He like chill low key you know what i'm saying he he a good one so i'll say seven to shay that motherfucker is a goofball okay so i'm going to give him an eight just because he was just all over the place and i think the shay would be my pick because i am funny he's funny we both can get along you know what i'm saying and that's what i like so uh, so my question was have y'all ever been cheated on and damn she got that drip on ain't it Rip pants with the beanie. What she know about the beanies? Oh no. She had that drip on though. I'm fucking with her. Like, how'd y'all find out? No. That you know where? Not that I know Now that you know where. Yeah. Okay, okay. I got cheated on. How'd you find out though? Oh, you went through her phone? You really want, no, 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 no. You really want to know? Yeah. I swear to God, I'm not lying. I swear to God. <laughs> how'd you find out? So, so, you chilling, right? You start fucking, right? She start riding. Nah. Now listen, listen. I swear to God, everything, right. everything I love this is the truth. Okay. She start riding me, right? Okay, for sure. She start riding me. Shorty start crying. Mid ride, start crying, man. Listen, listen. She has some. I gotta tell you something. What you mean? You gotta tell me something. I fuck someone. Fuck. Oh. Ooh. Let me see, like, what? Did she tell you who it was? She told. She, she showed you and everything. Instagram, bro. Okay, how did you feel about that though? Like, I'm like. Fuck, bro. You know so like, y'all was still. I stopped fucking. So I didn't. Like, I didn't finish. Like, I kicked her out after that. Okay. But I'm saying, yeah, she told me mid ride. I'm like, mid ride is crazy though. She could have told him before, after. Some girl not tell you at all. I feel like you should have told me after that, that so I'd have been blessed. Like, right, because after that you now probably ain't even. Is all up. Yeah. <laughs> but nah, she told me mid ride, and I'm like, damn, bro. damn like. That's all right, crazy. For sure. That's rapper crazy. and all, I'm like, damn. Damn. But I was more lit than the rapper though. It didn't hurt your ego. Really? The same story. <laughs> <laughs> I told hey, that's the thing though. These females, well, they will fuck any nigga, bruh. So it's like, you can't even take them too serious. Cause it's like, they choosing up. They choosing up on whoever. 
That way you never catch me taking a hoe too serious, cause they just choosing up on whoever can go down and pay their bills, buying this and that, buying purses and shit, or, you know what I'm saying? Whoever satisfying them at the moment, bro. And none of these females is hot. I wouldn't recommend none of these females for a long time. You know what I'm saying? Some of us, it's my, maybe like a good small little percentage or whatever type shit. But most of these females, bro, they just fucking whoever. They just partying every night. Like, them females, they just, what would you call them? Stragglers. They just some little stragglers, man. You can't even take them little stragglers serious. Them hoes that go, that you find in a club and you take them home. You getting there on the first night type shit. These hoes, like, you can't take them serious, bro. You, bro, my love life is traumatic. That's why I don't trust hoes no more. Like, if you want a bad boyfriend, I'm the one. I'm, I don't I'm want good. no boyfriend. But you, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even say anything. But anyway, um, ooh, y'all got Casamigos. Which you, we want to shot? Do the only Not y'all got Casamigos. Y'all do want to shot. I'm retired. Bro. That's what I'm saying. Like you dead ass had one job. Come on. Now I'm finna pick him. Ooh, damn, cause I split the shot. Cause now you just split the shot. Don't do my. Why right, these hoes here, bro? It's like when you pouring a shot into the girl's mouth. Of course, it's supposed to be clean most of the time, but be for real, like, yeah, I know in the bottle full, that shit gonna like go down the bottle a little bit. Like, what she thought that bit was going a hundred percent going her mouth. Like, you should pour your own damn shot. The fuck, you should pour your own damn shot, ho. Like, do not blame him, cause the shit wastes on your goddamn lip, like. She pulled your own goddamn shot. The fuck are you talking about? Man, like that? Stop playing. the lick on her and shit but goddamn shit he trying to get you more lit see what i'm saying he trying to get you more lit the fuck is you talking about She don't deserve to be here, so I hope in five years that bitch dead and I can move on. Oh my, my god! Shoot. Okay. Like I don't want you dealing with my baby mama for real. Don't you don't like baby mama? She can't be that bad, huh? She you can't know how be to that fight? bad. She used yeah. to fight over cornbread. She can have you. Nah, nah, I don't want that though. I'm trying to get away. From you. I want you to change my life for real. Can you fight? Okay, I can. Okay, bet. I can. What about two fifty? Two fifty? No. We don't put it to the test. No. We, we can try, but nah. two fifty is crazy. In my life, and we don't see. Okay, and if I lose, then what? And if you lose, then you ain't ready for me then. Okay. I believe in you though. I'm gonna still try. If you lose, you can come over here. Okay. 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 Go. Go. You're not gonna have me in that situation. Okay. You're cool. Car, yeah. You're gonna put it up in the car. Just sit pretty. <laughs> okay, cool. Let me ask you this. You chilling with Avery, right? Mm -hmm. You got all in the wild, right? Mm -hmm. Y'all in the wild, y'all having a good time, y'all in the woods and shit like that. Y'all chilling, having the best time of your life. And it kind of comes, it's gonna bite your ass, right? It's like right here. As soon as it gets right here, that nigga Avery comes in the middle, pisses you out the way, and it bites his dick. <laughs> the only way you can do it is if you suck his dick. You suck the venom out of his dick. What? 
Nigga, what? Well, nigga, Deshay, what did you just say, nigga? That nigga Deshay funny, bro. What he said, bro? You know Avery, right? Mm -hmm. Y'all in the wild, right? Mm -hmm. Y'all in the wild, y'all having a good time, y'all in the woods and shit like that. Y'all chilling, having the best time of y'all life. And it kind of comes, it's gonna bite your ass, right? It's like right here. As soon as it gets right here, that nigga Avery comes in the middle, pushes you out the way, and it bites his dick. <laughs> the only way you can do it is if you suck his dick. You suck the venom out of his dick. But he oh, saved God. you, though. Mm -hmm. Is you sucking his dick to get the venom out? No, my mama was Damn. raised off. Why are you at every die? My mama ain't raised no hoe, but she's sucking dick. But <laughs> I got you. <laughs> so um, if an anaconda didn't come mm -hmm. and we are alone in the woods by ourselves, that same offer on the table? Yeah. <laughs> That's a victory. Wood pussy. I fuck with that. <laughs> I'm gonna give Avery a ten. Actually, I'm gonna give both a ten. They seem pretty, you know, cool. If the question's right, you know. I mean, the Shay's question did scare me a little bit though, because what you mean you want your baby mama dead? Like, damn. Who would I rather date? I'll yeah, the Shay did be on some other shit. Like he said, he want his baby mama dead. Like that's that's wild. Like he wilding for that one probably go for Avery because just like I said to Shay, you know, you want your baby mama dead and then you want me to fight your baby mama. I'm not with that. Like what? And she 250? No, I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to go with Avery. Yeah. How you guys feeling? Amazing. How about yourself? I'm doing good. I'm blessed. Okay, so question is, yeah. have you ever been in love with two women at the same time? And if so, who did you pick? Um, I was dealing with two women at the same time before. I just picked who I liked the most. But like, how did you make that decision? Like, what, what was... It was easy. One of the girls went good, the other one was good. Mm -hmm. What about with you? I had a threesome and one was on my balls and one was sucking me up. <laughs> and I had to figure out who would be the best contestant. They both started sucking me up. I went with the, the other one. So that's how I kind of choose. Which wait, wait. One got tired. She was like, I don't want to do that no more. The other one said, I'm a trooper. Wait, so you actually took her serious even though you had a threesome with her? What's wrong with taking somebody serious and have a threesome? That's a sexual preference. Okay. Like bigger balls. Both. <laughs> okay, don't say that. <laughs> How do you know when you're in love? You just know. Have you ever been in love before? I think so. And what was like, how would you describe it? Like, what is... Um, I just want to see that person. You want to just... So, what about you? How do you know when you're in love? Me, personally, when I just, honestly, just want to see you, for real. You know what I'm saying? Like, once I feel like you're attractive beyond, beyond the lust. But I feel like a lot of time, I feel like that period of the people believing that they're in love, I believe that it's lust. Am I in therapy? It's so like... Nah, she right though. That is true. Some people think they be in love and shit when really they just they just love what the person do for them. They just love that the person look good or the idea. They just love the idea or the thought of that person. But they really don't be in love for it. They just be talking. I'm just saying. You're going to make me cry and shit. <laughs> I feel like people love bomb in the beginning. So it's like, how long do you, you know, mm. once it once it go past that six month period, like, is you still interested? What keeps you still interested in this one person when there's so many options? Six, two, six months. Oh, okay. That's different. I don't fuck with you unless you have sex with me on the first night. Now, do that make you a whole fucking on the first night? All my girlfriends have had sex on the first night. I got deep. She got deep. Who you choosing, nigga? What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I have actually been a customer of Better Help for a little over two years now. And I was it's able to get a little bit of 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 a Okay, was it? It turned into two years. It started off like a sneaky link and then, you know, it turned off. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Thank you. You're welcome. If I had to rate both guys on a scale of one to ten, uh, for Avery, I'm gonna give him a nine, and for Deshay, I'm gonna give him a seven. Who would you rather date? When it comes down to it, personality-wise, wisdom thinking, I'm gonna just have to go with Avery on this one. So, what's your favorite childhood memory? Oh, my favorite childhood. She took. I heard memory is waking up for like breakfast on a Sunday morning. You know, you smell that smell. Me personally, I was like my first time ever like jacking off or some shit. Like, 
that shit. I remember my cousin, he had told me, like, How old were you? I was like, probably eight. We're talking about jacking off, and I was, he was like, I was like, what the fuck? He was like, yeah, white shit come out or some shit. He's like, you're too young, like, that shit not gonna come out. I'm like, nigga, bet. Went upstairs, typed in on YouTube, lesbian porn, started beating my shit, beating my shit, beating my shit. It was like a little dot of white shit. This nigga, this nigga just show you, bro. This nigga just be saying anything, bro. The picture of that shit showed my cousin and shit. Like, he was like, what the fuck, nigga? That shit out my face. Okay. It's good to know. That's it. No, you answered my question. Great. Thank you. Favorite sex position? Standing up. Okay. Standing up? For sure. Like this? Not like holding to the bottom. What you doing that long, guy? How much you weigh? Uh, 125. Now, me love. I like the leg, like on your side type shit. You know what I'm saying? On side, your legs right here. And then I turn my body to face so I can see my face. But if you want to be a bitch then, then I'm just going to turn my shit. That's it? Awesome. I would rate Deshae at an 8.5. I would rate Avery at a 9.5. I would rather date Avery because I want to see what he's talking about when he said he wanted to do it standing up. I'm a little foodie. My question to y'all is... If Damn, somebody holds... Some of these hoes tough. The last one was definitely tough in that little, in that little fitted little dress or skirt shit she had on. She was tough. Now she tough too. She definitely tough too. Light skin jump with the blind, the blind braids. Get crushed. If you could describe your past dating life as a restaurant, would it be fast food or dining? I shit like Shake Shack. <laughs> it's fast food, but it's still kind of good though. I said McDonald's. D but I said because you know you drunk, that shit hit. <laughs> oh God, you drunk that shit hit. But in the daytime, when you're in your right mind, you're like, fuck no, I'm not gonna eat this shit. You know what I'm saying? What about you? Like, describe a date where like you're you're gonna fuck them after. Gonna be a cute little, really like a beach date, little picnic, some, some outside. It's some chill for real, cause I hate doing too much. Some chill, but we could talk, smoke a blunt, eat some good food, and shit. You might like get that way after. Okay, so it's so a beach or some <laughs> restaurant. Okay, okay. I'm with that shit in a boy. You talking with short niggas? Depends. That shit. Depends on what? The inside, because. And what they got on, because I'm a big person on fit and shit. We had to choose one of us, take one of us home. Who are you choosing? I ain't gonna okay. care. I just told you I'm gonna put on um, fit and shit too. So I'm gonna have to go. That's the change up. That's the Atlanta. Basic. That's the Atlanta shit. And he got the skinny and little noodle, noodle jeans on. I can't even do that. Damn, why she get Straight on? Atlanta fit. Thank you. I appreciate so much. Okay. Good to see y'all. Avery, I'm gonna get her. He tried. She that Atlanta basic fit was not hitting though. I'm gonna give him coolers. Mm. But the shape, he might have been stepping this one time. I'm gonna give him an eight and a half. And who I would rather date? I'm gonna go with the shape. Only cause he can't step in today. I ain't gonna care. I'm dead, y'all. She took my Avery head on the little noodle jeans and shit. Like what the foot Oh no, type shit. She was wildin' for that one, man. But shit. I'ma fuck with y'all. See y'all niggas in this video, man. I thought you don't know we died by the green bed down. Stop my turn up. Cooking beef in the kitchen.